Please rise to greet the bride. <laughs> Who has the honor of bringing Brittany to marriage today? Congratulations. There is a time for everyone if they only learn that the twisting kaleidoscope moves us all in turn. There's a rhyme and reason to the wild outdoors when the heart of this star-crossed voyager beats in time with yours. Can you feel the love tonight? I think everyone here can feel the love. Dear family and friends, on behalf of Brittany and Jeremy, I welcome all of you to their fairy tale wedding celebration at the most magical place on earth. As Meg from Hercules said, People always do crazy things when they're in love. And yes, perhaps Brittany and Jeremy were a little crazy to ask all of you to travel to Walt Disney World for their wedding. But what better place in the world for them to celebrate their love and their marriage than right here and right now. We're gathered here to witness not the beginning of what will be, but rather to the next step of what already is their love for each other, and now their wish to spend the rest of their lives together as husband and wife. We rejoice and celebrate in the ways life has led them to each other and brought them to the place where they stand today. So, Brittany and Jeremy, before we go any further, I have some very important questions to ask each of you. Jeremy, do you take Brittany to be your wedded wife, to cherish in love and friendship, in strength and in weakness, good times and bad, to continue to take her to Disney parks, to love her faithfully today, tomorrow, and until the end of time? I do. Brittany, do you take Jeremy to be your lawful wedded husband, to cherish in love and friendship, in strength and in weakness, good times and bad, to always be his gym buddy, and to love him faithfully today, tomorrow, and until the end of time? I do. When I spoke with Brittany and Jeremy, and as I got to know them, I realized how much they loved one another, and I thought that their story might be interesting. So I asked them to share a little bit of their story and to write down a little paragraph or two about why they loved the other so much. Here's what Brittany said. I often joke that I fell in love with Jeremy the moment he belted out every word to a song from Tangled. <laughs> if anyone knows me well enough, they can rightfully assume that's true. But I'm in love with him for many other reasons as well. We are opposites, but that's what makes us fit so perfectly together. Jeremy is the extrovert to my introvert, and the optimist to my pessimist. He makes up for what I lack, and vice versa. He doesn't allow me to be sad for too long, always makes me laugh, and then convinces me that it will all work out. And he's always been right. Whenever he picks up a new hobby, he puts his heart and soul into it. To my good fortune, he picked up cooking. And he makes me dinner almost every night. He treats our puppies like real children, and it makes me excited to see him as a father someday. He listens when I talk about my dreams and then does everything he can to make them reality. He's actually the one who told me a Disney World wedding was even possible. He started off as one of my best friends, and now, after today, I'm lucky to also call him my husband. And here's what Jeremy said. I have a tendency to live confined within the lines. Brittany was there to disrupt my daily routine, in a good way. 
She was always there to color outside the lines. She would always brighten up my day, seeing her smile in my light color design class. She would make a six hour class go by so quickly. Listening to her stories about ballet and her past life has only made me fall in love with her more because of her strengths. Brittany is always supportive with what I'm passionate about. I'm big on fitness and she is there to be my partner in crime in the gym. She always pushes me to better myself. Above all, she is the one who took me to Disney for the first time in ages. It has now become a yearly tradition to go to Disney World every year. I love hearing her come home after work and listening to her excitement saying hi to Cubby and Luna with pure joy. Seeing her hold Cubby's hand and making growling noises to excite Luna makes me only more excited for when we have children of our own. When Jonathan, my brother, passed away in 2014, I was in a dark place, developing nasty habits and just being so negative. Brittany was always there to challenge me for the better. She has taught me to not bottle things up, and she also challenges me that angry and happy aren't the only emotions that exist, and it is okay to be sad. She has challenged me to be selfless, and her contagious, positive personality has made me the man I am today. The confidence I've built over time with her makes me feel honored and truly happy to be marrying her today. Brittany and Jeremy, from this day forward, this date, June 1st, will always have special meaning for you as the day you vowed to love and cherish each other in all ways, always. Each year when you come upon your anniversary, I encourage you to rededicate yourselves to the vows that you'll be making here today. Express your gratitude to each other for the ways that you have effectively loved and supported one another. Renew your love to each other by realizing that you are each other's new dream. Show each other that you can be trusted and counted on as a comfort when facing difficult times and celebrate abundantly the successes and joys that life brings your way. Let your love lead the way and be more important than anything else in the world. It's that love that has brought you here together today. My wish, and I'm sure the wish of your family and friends gathered here, is that that love grow deeper and sweeter with each passing year. The wedding ring that that you're going to exchange today, Brittany and Jeremy, are a symbol of eternity. The ring has no beginning and it has no end, and so it is with love. Love is a story that never ends. Brittany, with this ring. Brittany, with this ring. I pledge my love. I pledge my love. And faithfulness. And faithfulness. To you. To you. Today, today, tomorrow, tomorrow, and always, and always, as this ring has no end, as this ring has no end, neither shall my love for you, neither shall my love for you. Jeremy, with this ring, Jeremy, with this ring, I pledge my love, I pledge my love, and faithfulness, and faithfulness to you, to you, today, today, tomorrow, tomorrow, and always, and always. As this ring has no end, as this ring has no end, neither shall my love for neither you. shall my love for you. As you pour the sand, you're symbolizing the joining of your separate lives. And the filled vase will represent the unity that's formed with your new marriage. Now, just as these grains of sand can no longer be separated into single colors again, so Brittany and Jeremy, will your lives be forever united, never able to be separated again. Marriage creates from two committed spirits, one beautiful tree of life. Its roots are the trust and devotion that underlie each action, thought, and motive. Its branches are experiences shared, hopes realized, and dreams pursued. And its blossoms are the kisses, gentle words, and tender sighs that decorate each day and beautify the union of two 
loving hearts. Brittany and Jeremy, may your love and your marriage grow like a beautiful, healthy tree, sending roots deep and branches high with new beauty every season of your life together. Oh, and there's just one more wish here. Oh my goodness, I think it's here somewhere. Where could that darn thing be? Oh, there it is. Here's your special wish. May your lives together be filled with love and laughter. And may you live happily ever after. Inasmuch as you, Brittany, and you, Jeremy, have openly declared your wishes to be united in marriage, and in the presence of your family and friends have done the same by joining hands, by exchanging your vows and exchanging your rings, I now, by the authority vested in me under the laws of the state of Florida, am pleased to pronounce you husband and wife. Jeremy, go on and kiss the girl. Honored guests, please rise. It is with great honor that I present to you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Jeremy and Brittany Kim.